today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the noob cannon UGC in Mega Hide and Seek. So guys, here we are right now inside of Mega Hide and Seek. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get a brand new free limited UGC item, the um, Mega Hide and Seek noob cannon. Um, I'll not only be showing you how to get it, but I'll also be showing you how to get it fast. So without further ado, let's go on it. But if you are ever in need of Robux, go ahead and download this app called Playbite. And it's like an arcade on your phone. You guys can play fun games in a single app and win prizes for playing these games. One of those prizes is the official Roblox gift card. You can also win all kinds of other stuff from electronics to snacks to cool fidget toys. Go and download Playbite today, linked down below, and also use code GAMINGDAN. And by doing so, you'll be 10% of the way there to earn in your first $10 Robux gift card. So guys, pretty much, if you click on this cannon to the right, there is... Far, um, four different tasks so that is to win five rounds to use a cannon visit five different maps and find 20 hiders as the seeker so that's essentially what you guys need to go in and do now pretty much i'm going to be showing you guys how to get this over here um so essentially guys in order to go in and do this to be fair it would be a lot easier if of course we didn't get um found straight away i don't know how that happened guys of course of course the seeker spawns on us and um, yeah here we are just locked in locked in here but essentially guys what you need to do visit five different maps that's essentially just play the game and just go for go through five different maps win five rounds just either don't get um found or you need to find everyone before the time ends at the start at the top um use a cannon so the cannons are on the map i was just about to show you guys how to use them but as you guys can see just over there there is a cannon all you guys need to do is just use that cannon that i'll check off that one and um, hopefully wait, is this person gonna let me out i don't know okay yeah luckily enough they let me out however the seekers of course are, which is absolutely brilliant of course guys i can't show you anything when this is happening um absolutely typical isn't it guys however and um, the next and last one is of course to find 20 hiders as the seeker all you guys need to do is just be the seeker and if you guys are just find a bunch of different hiders and um, all you guys well the good thing is about seekers as well is that you can go ahead and go through the map a lot quicker which means that of course it's a lot easier to find people but uh, what happens when this countdown ends um right i think that means that people can let us out however yeah unfortunately the seeker has been just absolutely camping right on top of us two times um so i've not even been able to show you guys anything over here which is unfortunate but you know what i'm gonna join on into a new game where i can actually show you guys how to use this stuff I'll meet you back in a second so guys here we are back again essentially um yes yeah, so all you'll do will choose a game mode guys for example this one is gonna be two seekers um and we'll try this again now, hopefully this time we can actually go in and do this um properly over here so i think to visit five different maps one you probably need to like be in for the whole round so you can't just server hop for that i don't think however choose a map let's just hopefully get in this map guys as soon as possible it's the bedroom map and yeah um of course we'll go ahead and get some other stuff now i'm not too sure if there's like boost and stuff in this game which allows us to i don't know maybe go a bit faster i'm not really too sure of our chance to be the seekers eight percent chance would be good if we could that would, be, that would help the video out a bit but of course we are not and we need the second seeker over here guys are we gonna be the second seeker let's have a look over here guys who's the next seeker if it actually spins we are 10 percent chance to be the seeker and it's not gonna be us guys um unfortunately however that's fine because of course guys um i'll show you how to use the cannons and all sorts of stuff so pretty much here we are it'll just be like this and um, you'll probably have to do this across a few rounds um but essentially guys i don't know if there's any cannons in this one um I don't know how this person's got a sword but yeah um of course guys there's no cannons in this this one at least i can't find any cannons but if you, you did see in the map before there was a few cannons i think that's a cannon down there so maybe we can use that one fortunately i don't want the seeker um well i don't know if the seeker will be coming anywhere nearby but yeah guys essentially just look for the cannons there's one down there um, so I have to quickly use that. I don't think there's any other cannons nearby, so let's keep on going over here. There's also another cannon on the bed there, guys. Um, but yeah, there's it seems to be cannons in every single map. Some might have more than others, but essentially, guys, general rule, you'll probably find a few cannons here and there. So here's this cannon. Let's just hopefully not come into contact with a seeker. And essentially, all you need to do is just run into one. And I see you right now, guys. Um, use a cannon for some reason. Um, none of this is taken well no, yeah for some reason it's not recording my progress maybe we need to wait until the round ends potentially but that's pretty much going to be it for this video here like and subscribe for more